Warrior Land sent me out some products to review. This is the crossbow light and green laser combo. Uh, with the bright sunshine out here, it's pretty hard to see the light in the laser, but we're still gonna put it through the ringer, see if it handles the recoil, and then go back to the studio and see how it works. Welcome back to Sawteeth Tactical. I did a collaboration with Warrior Land um, probably about a year or so ago on a light for the Sig Sauer P365. And one of the things that I loved about the light that they sent me is that it actually came with a holster, an IWB concealed carry holster that fit the pistol with the light which I felt like was, you know, really smart thinking on their part because a big part of, you know, when you modify your carry gun, well, then you have to find a holster company that'll make a holster that works with whatever light, laser, whatever you put on it. And that can be a problem. And so I thought that that was very smart of them to include a decent Kydex holster with their light. Well, they reached out to me again recently uh, to do another collaboration and they sent me a few things. I initially, when I looked at their website, I was like, I could really use an outside the waistband holster for my government length 1911. And they were like, sure, we'll send you that, but we're gonna send you some other stuff as well. And so that's mainly what we're gonna be talking about today. So make sure you're subscribed and let's talk about these products. Crossbow light and laser combo, it is universal. So it fits on almost any gun, and I love to try things out on my dagger. Uh, it's just the perfect, perfect platform for testing products that get sent to me. And uh, I zeroed this, the laser on it, before I came out here. So we'll put a bunch of rounds through it, and then when we get back, see if it's still zeroed. So besides the 1911 holster, which is something that I really needed and I definitely appreciate, they sent me two of their newest products. And the first one we're gonna talk about is the crossbow. It's a light and laser combo. And I'm gonna start this with a little bit of a caveat that I don't normally put lasers on my pistols. When I bought my very first pistol, I did get a laser for it. And I bought a cheap laser off of Amazon and I was very frustrated with it. And as I have grown and learned more about firearms, I now put lights on all of my guns, but not lasers. You see lights on all these. And in fact, there was a Streamlight TLR1 HL on this PSA dagger that I took off in order to put the Warrior Land crossbow on here. But the great thing about this is that it does have a very good high quality light and a laser, and it has a bunch of different modes. You can run it just the light, just the laser, or both. And I actually think that it is pretty effective when you're running both. And I think the biggest reason why, so I actually really trust this PSA dagger. It's a Gen 3 Glock 19 clone. I use it a lot for videos testing out products that are sent to me, different red dot optics, different lights, things like that. Um, and it's a really good platform to test because it's a Glock clone. It has a standard Glock accessory rail and most companies make products that fit Glocks. Warrior Land is no exception there. And this is a universal mount for this light and laser combo. It works on a bunch of different Glock models. In fact, it works on a bunch of different pistol models, not just Glocks, which is very cool. But what I think would be really cool for this, this is a pistol that I trust. It's very reliable. And in fact, I've got one of those magnetic uh, like pistol slide holders on the little table next to my bed that 